Hey guys, welcome back to Cooking with Najiba. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a Hague fish curry. Not only is it gorgeous, but it's light and coconutty, also tangy, everything you want in a fish curry. So if you want to learn how to make this gorgeous recipe, stick around because I'm about to show you. Let's get started with our ingredients. For this recipe, you will need mini Hague fish fillets, a lemon, red chilies, crushed tomatoes, red habaneros, garlic, green peas, red onion, coriander, coconut cream, butter, oil, aromat, haldi, jeera, garam, dania, mustard seeds, black pepper, and salt. These are all the ingredients we're gonna need for this recipe. Now let's get cooking. Please make sure to use a non-stick pan because you do not want your fish to stick to the bottom of your pan. Lightly season the fish with salt and pepper and fry just until cooked and no longer translucent, then set aside. And repeat the step with the rest of your fish. To the same pan, go ahead and add some butter, followed by your onion and a teaspoon of mustard seeds and let this cook for 3 to 4 minutes. Now add your garlic and chilies and cook for another 3 minutes and remember guys, if you're not a fan of chilies, you can go ahead and skip this chili step. Add the masala, then stir in your crushed tomatoes as well as your habanero chilies and continue to cook on medium-low heat for another 3 minutes. Now add your coconut cream and season well with aromat. You may substitute this with salt if you wish. Followed by your peas and cook for another 4 minutes with the lid on. Return the fish back to this delicious sauce and gently cook for another 5 minutes and finish off with a squeeze of a lemon and roughly chopped coriander. And serve this immediately on a bed of jasmine rice and enjoy! And now for my favorite part, the taste test. That looks so delicious. It's nice and soft. And it smells so good. Wow. Honestly, it's nice and tangy. It's coconutty. It's fresh. It's light. It's just the perfect balance of everything. You guys have to try this and let me know what you think. Alright you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, give me a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos. Also like and comment in the comment section below, let me know what your thoughts are and what you would like to see me cook next. Thank you so much for watching this video, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!